Good morning, everybody. And today we're gonna to be taking a first class train ticket from Frankfurt, Germany to Strasbourg, France. I'm gonna show you what that includes. It is very, very early here in Frankfurt. So I apologize for how dark it is, but you do get access to a lounge with a first class ticket. These are the hours. Now, nothing's really included. There's not a whole lot of food, but there is a resting area here in Frankfurt. As you'll see, it's just kind of an upper sitting area in this terminal, but we're cutting it a little close, so we're gonna get walking. All right, here we go. So we ended up finding out that these seats are not the quote unquote first class seats that were sold to us through Rail Europe. Regardless, they were still super, super comfortable. One thing to note when you are getting on trains in Europe, aside from getting a delicious pretzel, is make sure you get in the right car because some trains, depending on where you're going, will split off. It's time to explore Strasbourg. This station was super easy. The subway station and rail station that takes you into Strasbourg is right below the main train station. You just buy those little cards and we stayed at the Maison Rouge for two nights. Loved this hotel. It's so beautiful. This is an autograph collection hotel by Marriott. So if you are a Bonvoy fan or if you like traveling and earning points, highly recommend this room was very comfortable and honestly it was very spacious for a European hotel room. We had a king size bed. We had a beautiful patio area and this is full service. So there was dining on board. We had room service one morning. We also used the spa. Highly, highly recommend this property. It is so cute. And the location is fantastic. So when we checked in, they gave us a Christmas market map. It does open up tomorrow, which we are super excited for. There's 300 stalls and two squares but it kind of looks like they're sprinkled a little bit throughout. Since it was a very early morning, we took a quick nap, but then we headed out for a bite to eat. So in Strasbourg, you're going to get Alsatian cuisine that is very specific. So don't expect the same types of foods that you get elsewhere in France. I mean, there is escargot, it is France, but there's a lot of cheese, cream, potato kind of food here. Lots of ham, lots of pork products. This was fantastic. We know it's not super local. It is a beer pub chain, but it was fantastic. Also got some great stuff at the French pharmacy and the beauty of Strasbourg is just walking around. It is a beautiful city. It is the Capitale de Noël, and you will see why. I don't know why, but I blanked about being in France and I walked past a macaron shop, Olivia's favorite, so I had to get some to take home. I mean, just look at these decorations. Like, nighttime's gonna be inside, even all the way down there. Jeff, look. all these lights oh my gosh don't think it can get any better it gets better each place is decorated I just felt like I could not stop looking up all these buildings are so beautiful it's just all so cute <laughs> So we walked down to see where the boat we're going to take in about an hour picks up and I'm just so excited now. Then it was time to head out on our boat tour. This took approximately about an hour or so, but I would highly recommend it to anybody. It was so beautiful to see Strasbourg from this level. You get to go through a few different locks to see how that works through Petit France, which you will see a little time lapse of coming up. But I mean, if you think walking the streets of Strasbourg is beautiful, seeing it by boat is even more beautiful. Plus there's great audio guides available in several different languages. But for about the next uh, minute or so, I'm going to let you guys enjoy this little ride and we'll just interject a little bit. Can 
here's one of those little locks. I'm gonna do a time lapse. This is right over by Petit France. So you can actually, when you're in Petit France, see this happen as well from land, which I highly recommend doing as well. So when I said there were two tours available, there is the one that starts and ends at the cathedral. There is one that also gets off at the European Parliament building. If you didn't know, that is located here in Strasbourg as well. We opted to just do the round trip cathedral one and not get off, but these do run mostly year round. I mean, this is, you know, Thanksgiving time, so late November. And these tours are still available. It wasn't cold. The weather was beautiful. We were very, very lucky. And of course, here's the European Parliament building. Very, very different architecture compared to other parts of Strasbourg. Strasbourg by night is absolutely breathtaking as you can see during the holiday season. I did stop at Louis Vuitton and get myself a new work bag. She's beautiful, she's the moment. And of course you get a champagne and snacks. We also bought Olivia a little purse. We're kind of starting a tradition of trying to get her a little luxury piece every year to have a little collection. Yes, it might be bougie and over the top, but it's our thing. Just look at this street. And here's dinner. Jeffrey, how is your uh, local Coca Cola? Okay. <laughs> Little uncivilized here. It tastes like it's related to Coke. It actually kind of tastes like a Diet Coke, and I'm digging it. I cannot say enough nice things about this restaurant. The food was fantastic. The staff was great, super Alsatian, highly recommend. You smell off when I keep you around. <laughs> Try the side without the jam, Jeffrey. Oh my god, you are such a baby. <laughs> Don't listen to Jeffrey, he's a big baby. This fugua is fantastic. I think it's the best fugua I've ever had, actually. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and please feel free to ask questions in the bottom. There's gonna be another Strasbourg video coming out and there's also travel tips videos. I will be putting together travel tips for European Christmas markets, so don't forget to subscribe. See you guys next time and thank you so much for watching.